for Wrestle Bash is going to be Maddox versus Blackwell. We also want to announce that the special guest referee for that contest is going to be Scott Armstrong. Yeah. At this time, we would like to bring out our current CCW champion, Miles Blackwell. For over a year and a half, the violent gentleman Miles Blackwell has reigned as the CCW Heavyweight Champion. And now at Wrestle Bash 33, he will face off against the man he stole the championship from, the machine, Bryce Maddox. We thought we were getting a word from Miles Blackwell. The crowd not letting him speak. Yeah, this is. Uh, if you're going to talk about me, why don't you talk about how I've been champion for well over 400 days? Standing nothing. Standing nothing. Perfect champion. You suck. And you cheat everybody. But let's, let's take a moment to not actually talk about me, the most important person in CCW history. Oh, the most go. dominant champion in CCW history. Let's, let's talk about my challenger at WrestleMatch. Let's talk about my challenger. It seems to me that once again, Bryce Maddox gets to skip to the front of the line, bypass everyone. We all know. Here is the former champion, the machine Bryce Maddox, locking eyes on the current champion and his opponent at Wrestle Bash 33. Bryce is wasting no time getting right in the ring. This is going to be a good showdown here, Jimmy. My question is, is Russell Bash 33 start right now? Quite a different ovation that Bryce Maddox got than Miles Blackwell. to me about skipping the line like I haven't done everything to prove myself to this company. Yeah. Yeah. Like I haven't beat every person in this locker room except for you. Correct. Let's talk about me for a minute. If, if you all will afford me the luxury to tell you a very brief story, I promise this is all going to make sense, even for the simplest minds. When I was a child, when I was a child, I made the mistake of putting my hand on the stove because I burned my hand. And when that happened, I learned my lesson. Hey, wake me up! My question to you is, how many times is this going to happen before you learn your lesson? Because here's the thing, you mentioned it. I'm the only guy that you can't beat one-on-one. -on -one. Right? It doesn't matter what you do. Listen to me. 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 Listen to me.
when you come back, I'm going to beat you. Okay? You can you can take on whatever formidable Whoa. monster comes in every once in a while in CCW. Yeah. You can play Rocky Balboa, but when you're done, I am going to beat you. No, you do you understand no, me? You, you can do your little radio spots, no, your you promos, won't. your autographs, but when that's done, I am going to beat you. Okay? Wow. And, and one more thing, one more, actually two more things. You can have all your friends from WWE, AEW, and Ring of Honor who kick in that door to train in the ring that I cut my teeth in. But when you're done training with them, I am going to beat you. And lastly of all, it does not matter what referee you bring in for this match. You can bring in the Easter Bunny, your fiance, your father, or your cat. I am going to beat you. One, two, three in this ring. So my question to you is, how many times are you going to put your hand on the stove before you learn your bloody lesson? Give him a minute, give him a minute. <laughs> you're frustrated, I get it. I get it, you're frustrated. Your entire title reign has only been surrounded around Bryce Maddox. You haven't quite had that, that edge. You haven't had that person that, that, that pushes you. Their phones are going off right now because there's an emergency in your career. Yeah. Miles has one thing over me, and that is I have never beaten him in CCW. I have yeah. never pinned you in this ring. Those, those trials and those tribulations, to me, that's just a champion story. And no matter how many times I fall down, I get back up. And I get back up because of the unwavering support of these people. Yeah. Yeah. I, I stand here today. I am standing in this ring across from you today preparing for WrestleBash 33. Not the same man I was when you beat me. Not the same wrestler I was after all of those failures. I am a different person. I am leaps and bounds above the competition. You can't touch me anymore, Miles. Is that WrestleBash 33, August 24th. I don't care that Scott Armstrong is going to beat him. That's just an added bonus because now, now you don't have a way out. You can't cheat. I am going to walk out of those doors the CCW World Heavyweight Champion. Bryce Maddox has been through hell and back over the last year. Had trials and tribulations. But to become the CCW Heavyweight Champion, will he be able to do the one thing he can never do? And that is beat the violent gentleman, Miles Blackwell. in a bad mood, always ready to throw fists. And with the support of the brotherhood behind him, he's a dangerous individual.
Prince Tito making his return to Stomping Ground Studio for the first time since that shocking assault from Alexander Presley, earning the Outcast an indefinite suspension from CCW. And once again, fans, we would like to apologize for the actions of Alexander Presley. And we hope that Prince Tito has made a full recovery from that sneak attack. Yeah, I was surprised he was going to be in action um, here on Surge, but um, it looks ready to go. He's going to have a battle with, with Shooter. Shooter McGee, not only them, not only him, but the Brotherhood outside. As we know, Jimmy, they, Chris Turner always plays a, a big role in these matches. And whenever Chris Turner's involved, his bodyguard, the million dollar Marvel maid, is right behind. And now this match is official tonight on Surge. Jimmy Rosendorf, Matt Potak here at ringside as Prince Cito from Seville, Espana is one on one yeah. with Shooter McGee. That 2023 Rookie of the Year, Prince Cito. The high flyer. Shooter a little bit more. Strength. Yeah, Shooter, a ground and pound wrestler. But Prince Tito, using the lessons learned from his grandfather, applying a very nice hold there on the left arm. Taken down with an arm drag and maintains control. Prince Tito looks good right now, Jimmy. He, he's moving well. Um, I know he was injured, but um, looks like he recovered. And I hope we don't see Alexander Presley in CCW for a long time after what he did to Prince Tito. Yeah, that was that was awful. That was that was we don't condone that. Um, you know, Alexander Presley is a, a, a very sick individual. Uh, I wouldn't be surprised, though, Jimmy, if, even though he is suspended indefinitely, you never know with that guy. I don't think he has any care in the world right now. And luckily, no fans were injured yes. in that attack. Yeah, that was very dangerous. But once oh, again, oh, Chris Turner and Maeve making their presence known. They are. Giving you know, Shooter McGee the advantage here over Prince Zito. A, a seasoned veteran, been around a long time. He doesn't do. Obviously, working with Chris Turner, Maeve. I mean, the Brotherhood. It's it's a, it's a, a very dangerous combination, dude. Ooh, oh, Shooter McGee said shoulder first into the into the post here, and these are squared off posts. Yes, that had hurt. That hurt. Shooter's hurt right now, Jimmy, and, and cedo has got to take advantage of this. You know, he's looking over at Turner. He's looking over at May. He, oh. Now, Cito's in, in, in trouble now. Yeah, there's, I don't think there's a situation that Shooter McGee has not been in, using that to his advantage. Yeah. And now the boot across the throat. I'm not sure if Shooter can count much past five, but he knows if he gets to five, he's disqualified. Yes, he, he knows is. to let go at four. I don't know if Shooter cares, though. He's just trying to inflict like, punishment on Prince Cito. <laughs> Turner's getting into it with a referee now. Oh! Prince Cito going for the pin. Not enough to end the match. Another close near fall, Jimmy. I, two very good, very good guys, very good athletes. Cito a little bit quicker, shooter a lot stronger, so they got to use their strengths to their advantage. Ooh, shooter kind of rushed it there. Shooter's out. And this might be it. Prince Cito going for the pin. Shooter McGee able to once again get his shoulder up at two. Shooter lost conscious for a second or two. He was out. His head hit the mat. He was not moving. And that might have been the last bit of effort he had. He can't get back to his feet. Yeah, he's hurt. And, uh, definitely not a crowd favorite, Shooter McGee. He's getting, uh, getting an earful from the crowd. So is the Brotherhood in general. But taking coaching from Chris Turner there. Yeah. Able to connect. Nope, not able to connect with the suplex. Chris Turner going to the ropes. O'Connor roll, rolls up. Shooter McGee. Shooter McGee able to kick out. This is the pace that Prince Tito needs to wrestle at. Oh, oh my I God. Tito, 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 Tito. But those injuries from the 
Attack from Alexander Presley might be catching up to shooter yeah. uh, uh, Prince Zito. Prince Zito with the clothesline. Going for the pin. Shooter McGee once again able to kick out. Got the, got the crowd definitely into it here on serve. Comeback here, Jimmy. And there's that ground and pound style. Yes. Of Shooter McGee. Not pretty, but it is effective. Well, like we said earlier, you know, Shooter's, Shooter's a veteran. He's been around a very long time here in CCW. He's done a lot of, lot of great things, but he, he's definitely a, he's a, he's a punter. He wants to hurt his opponent. He is, you know, I've talked to him many times. He is, he is, his game plan, he wants to hurt you. He wants to hurt you bad. He does not care. And, uh, you know, anytime you're in the ring with him, you, you gotta, you gotta protect yourself. You gotta be ready for uh, a violent encounter. Prince Hidu fighting back. Yeah. You know, you gotta use that, that speed and endurance. Taking flag, oh, taking out, goodness. shoot him again. Falls across for the cover. Still not enough. Yeah, we got him. What does Prince Tito have to do to put away Shooter McGee? Shooter's hanging in there. Brotherhood, not much of a factor, Jimmy. Not much of a factor right now. But you know, that's being in the back of Tito's mind. Yeah. Zetosis connects! Got it! Zetosis connects! Cross for the cover! And that'll do it! You got him! Prince Zito picks up a hard-fought win in his return to Stomping Ground Studio and CCW Surge for the first time since that brutal attack by Alexander Presley. This is exactly what Zito needed to get his career back on track. Great win by Prince Zito. A lot of momentum from that one. Beating Shooter McGee. And the Brotherhood, that's a huge win. Not an upset because a lot of people with the support Cito has. Oh, oh what's that? that? What's that? Oh, my God. Cito got. Oh, no. Oh, it's Skylar Chaos. Skylar Chaos. Oh, my goodness. She, she, Cito got hit right in the, in the eye with that fireball. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, Skylar Chaos shooting up flames from hell right at Prince Cito.